why you shouldn't buy any of the cars on Walsh Rock Custom Carry. And most of you will be like, yeah, why? Some of them are quite good. Yes, some of them can be quite good. Some of them can be quite fun. But the fun could be very easily taken out of these three vehicles. It can easily be taken out of the fire truck, that other random truck, I don't actually know what it is, and the armored truck. And why can't I take the fun out of it? Because they're all Pegasus. So, why buy them? They're Pegasus vehicles. They can't be in your garage, they can't be upgraded, and they're slow as fuck. Other than the fire truck, they're decently alright. But, the van? Why why would you want a van? Just get the wheels get the wheels and news van and put the nearest paint drop on it that you can. There you go, I've just saved you six hundred grand. And the two lifeguard vehicles, you can get both of them for free. So it's either they're Pegasus vehicles, it's completely useless, or you can get the car for fucking free. And you're probably like, where the fuck do you get it for free? Well, for them two lifeguard vehicles, this one and that one, I'll be showing you where to find them. But first off, let me just show you that I do already have one of these vehicles. And it's this one. And it's obviously then the quad, because the lifeguard car, although you can get it for free, it's much, much, much rarer to get that than this. Which I'll explain later, but I got this ages ago from one of the huts at the, uh, at the beach. Uh, the Los Santos Beach, not the one up in Sandy Shores, the Los Santos Beach. And just to prove to everyone who's going to say, no, I already bought it, it's only 62k, I bought it, I bought it, shut up. Alright, I didn't buy it, and just to prove it, I'm just going to go over to Los Santos Customs and just prove that you can actually drive this in. There you go, you can drive it in, it's not one of these weird duplicate ones that you can't drive in or all of that bullshit, but you need to say, without that out of the way, the way you get this for free is just simply going to the beach and they'll be parked by the lifeguard's hut. That's literally it. You don't have to have one of these, they will just spawn randomly. Uh, you might see that in a clip later, but you don't have to have one of them. Yes, it will increase your chances of getting one quicker, but they will still spawn quite frequently. There's usually at least one or two of these on the beach, and just to show that this is the one I just got off the beach. I'm not going to put it in the exact same garage as the other one. Put them side by side and just show you that, uh, you know, I did get it. Now, I didn't cut this black screen out. I normally would, but people would probably think, oh, no, I went out and bought it again on whatever, you know, although I literally just showed me driving it in. But some people can be stupid around uh, nowadays. So I decided just to show the black screen, so sorry for the long wait, sorry for my rambling just then, but now let's get into the garage, and you can clearly see that it's already there, but just to prove my point even stronger, I'm going to place this one and run over there, and there you go, there are two of them right there. Now, also, you can actually sell this for 6200 so if you did buy one of these, go to the beach, spawn it in like 10 times, and then you made your money back, just sell them, you made your money back with this thing. There you go. I guess you could call that a money glitch. Sort of. Whatever. But now, moving on to the lifeguard car. Uh, it was so rare I couldn't find it. I spent about half an hour, 40 minutes just driving up and down the beach. Spent like, well, basically the entire day, so about 45 minutes, 40, 45 minutes, driving up and down here and I couldn't find it. But back to the Bugs Bunny. Uh, Bugs Bunny? I've been playing so much arcade games. Back to this bug car. It's a van. It's, it's 600 grand and two seater. The, f the fuck are you doing if you buy this? What are you doing? But the lifeguard car, unfortunately, it's way too rare. So if you do really want this and you are actually a true fan of this car, you'll have to buy it for the full price. Or you can spend a long time to try and find it on the beach. There is no way to just try and find it. I don't know if you already have one of these cars. Like, say, if you did buy it, you could then go to the beach and sell it. Again, if you did buy it and you go to the beach and you can't find it, just sell 10 of them, and then you made your money back because all Rockstar does just takes a number off at the end. But that building right I just passed then, that's where it usually spawns, especially in single player. Single player, it's a lot easier to find it, but at the end of the day, we're in online, 
you want it in online, and it's just really fucking rare to get it in online. But, however, with all that said and done, don't buy any of these cars or vehicles or anything. Half of them are either Pegasus, or they're just completely useless, or you can get them for free. So don't buy any of them, they're a complete waste of money. Save, I believe it's like 6 million if you buy all of them at the full price, so save your money. But, anyways, that does it for this video. If you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe, all of that shit. Channel's growing quite well. Thank you all so much for 200 subs. It means so much more. Let's get to 300, and I'll see you guys in the next one, which we'll be posting very soon.